at these windows. They're open. Can I jump out them? Oh, God. I do not want to jump out that window. My God. Eek. But we did see something beneath the wing, which I was trying to access earlier. Can I maybe float down there from here? Is that a good point by which to do so? Should I overcome my fear of heights and see if I can fly over there? Yes. Oh, God. Hi. Yeah, I'm as surprised as you are. Trust me. Oh, no! No! Oh! Oh, God. Oh, this thing slides back and forth. I could have just ridden it across. Ha! Huh. Did not know that. Well, that certainly would have been less terrifying. Somebody's going to watch this video and say, Oh, my God, Ken, why did you make it so hard on yourself? And here's a little passageway. Right after the other terminal. Schmear! Ha! 40% of the way done. Authenticated. There are three terminals remaining. Keep going. But, although not as the game intended for me to approach it, although counterintuitive or unintuitive, I nonetheless learned something about how this beast works, and I can apply that knowledge elsewhere in the level to access even more terminals. So that was a growth opportunity right there. Yes. But how do I get onto that ladder? Well, let's start by riding this thing all the way. Oh. Right. I see it now. Alright. Keep going a little bit more, a little bit. Just slidey enough. And I'll balance it out here and jump on this thing. Yeah. Actually, let's uh, stay here for a moment. Activate my magnetic rune. Drag it all the way over here so it's not in the way of the other thing. Now I'm going to tilt it that way. And I'm going to jump on this thing as it slides past. Like so. And I'm totally going to miss the ladder I was trying to jump onto. But that's okay. Because I could just do the slightly tilty thing again. Just enough to get over there. There we go. Oh, come on. A little bit more, please. There we go. Now, I, I presume this is the side I should be climbing? Yes. There's going to be an eyeball up here. So, shoot that thing. Oh, and a chest. Is it going to drop a chest, the thing I just shot? Oh, it's just going to burn until I open this chest. Great. I did not see it drop a chest. So let's not go looking for one right now. Ooh, a whole new room. This is exciting and terrifying. Oh, I heard a, I heard an eyeball. In there. Oh, God. Look at that mouth. That is terrifying, the way it's just suspended. Whew. Does it kill the skull when I kill the eyeball? No. Skulls are still here. Great. Die. And don't leave anything for me to collect. Not like I wanted your guts. Okay, I'm probably going to want to get up there because that's a terminal. Right there. Yup. And there's some windows here that probably open. There's a switch over there that I will examine thoroughly in a moment. Uno momento. And I'm here. And that's probably how I want to get over there. There's probably some sort of a rotation of the bird that will enable access. In the meantime, let's try this thing out. Ah, oh, yeah. Yep. Ah! Oh, wind! Fire, earth, water, heart. Okay. That wind is... Uh, hmm. It's too low. Isn't it? Can I make that jump? Is there enough... Huh! I can! I can make that jump! Now I'm more than half done! How exciting! There are two terminals remaining. You're almost there. It's true! I am almost there! And I feel pretty good about that. So thanks! Did I see something else? Oh, there's a chest. Alright, I'm gonna want to get that. How do I get that? How do I 
jump over there? And what is all that stuff? And what? how do I get in there? And what's going on? And I need to put a bomb in here. Whew, okay, that was a lot of thoughts. I want this arrow. And the bomb missed. Let's try oh, God, come on, really? Stupid bomb. How do I get it in there? There we go. Oh, I need to tilt the bird. There we go. And kaboom! Oh, another one of the giant peg things. Looks like I need to tilt this the other way now and get it to smash into this wall. What? Is that, is that what's happening? Is it going to move toward me? Am I going to get smushed? What's happening? Why is nothing happening? Do I need to use another bomb? Is that what's going on here? Do you want me to bomb the thing? And you need to... S oh! God. <laughs> Silly little bomb. Thought you could get away from me. Let's try this again. Maybe there's something else I need to bomb now? No, it's just gonna keep going. Because the wind is blowing it. Ah! A magnetic sphere that I can now roll over here and magnesis through the barrier and onto some sort of button, I guess? Come on, come to Papa. Come to Papa Link. Papa Link, Papa Link, Papa Link. Yeah! Okay. I am magnesising the heck out of this thing. I'm gonna put it right there. I'm gonna tilt the bird the other way. And that is not a euphemism, tilt the bird. Make sure it's in the right spot. There we go. Oh, I, I wanna close this, don't I? Because I don't want the wind blowing it out of the way. Yeah! Woo! And hopefully that purple miasma does not permeate the entire room and I can continue my exploration uninhibited. Let's just keep this tilt, because that's kind of cool. Hello. She could slate authenticate. Just one terminal remaining. <laughs> what do you know? More than you ever did. Because I am curious and willing to learn. Unlike some people. But how do I get that chest? Okay, where is the last terminal? It's below me below me. Okay. First, I want this chest that I'm missing. I don't know how I get it. Oh, oh, this angle is dizzying me. I don't think I can magnesis that. No, definitely not. I can't. Oh, yes! Wow, that should not have worked. I mean, it probably was the correct way to get it, but I nonetheless feel like I just exploited a bug, which is kind of cool. Okay, I need to drop something. I don't need to drop something. I want to drop something. I'm going to drop my knight's broadsword. Because it's the weakest weapon I have. If I drop it, I mean throw it! And it didn't break. Cool. Maybe it's so durable that I should have kept it. But no. Royal Claymore. Great. Have I found one of these before? Uh, let me check. Yeah, that's not new to me. Claymores are pretty cool. I like claymores. It's what I've been using for most of this level. Okay, so I need to... Oh my god. I need to make this easier to walk, first of all. Whew. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, so it's below me. So that probably means... Okay, so it has one of those tracks up there. So does that mean that there is a... A thing I can ride, like before? I just need to slide it over here? No, apparently. And yet, there is the last terminal. Sounds like an old movie, The Last Terminal. Starring Robert Preston. So how do I get over there? Do I need to fly again? Do I need to do something that doesn't look like it should work, but it will? Whew, this is terrifying. What if I tilt it and then try flying? Will I fall and fly right into it? Because I'll be falling at an angle? Will my little ear things help me fly? 
This seems like a really bad idea. But I don't know what else to do, so... Oh! That's Rito Village. Remember why I'm fighting! Oh my gosh! Hey, it's working. Was not expecting that. I hope... I guess I just have to tilt it the other way to get back? Whew. That was so much easier than the camel. That was the last terminal. Now you just need to start the main control... And fight a boss. Don't forget that. I want you to take a good look at your map. There should be a new glowing point on there. Well... Well? Flap to it. Oh, goodness. Flap yourself. Oh, look at Linky shaking. It's almost like he's scared or terrified. I've felt exactly what you're going through, Link. By which I mean standing on a giant rotating bird. Whoa! Okay. You were not ready for that, were you? No chests in here. So let's go back the same way we came. Oh, God. Oh, my God. I'm actually hitting the top of the bird. I'm at a stronger angle than it. Whew. I feel like I missed some chests. I feel like that was so rapid that there must be something else. But no, probably. I think that is everything. So let's use this little perch that we made available to us. Oh, oh, there we go. That's better. And that's the last terminal right there, the master terminal. Let's uh, check out the edges here. Not because I think there are chests, but because this is about to become a battleground. And it behooves us to be familiar with the terrain. Also, is this the weapon I want to be using? Maybe. I don't think I want to be equipping my barbarian gear. Although I'd certainly appreciate the boost to my attack. Maybe some bananas instead? Uh, I, I really don't know what foods I have handy. I don't often need them. I don't know if I have any fairies left, because I used one recently. Okay. Well then, I guess I'm as ready as I'm going to be. Let's get that camera ready, because I'm about to see something the likes of which you've never seen before. Uh, let's see. Woo! Alright. Oh, it didn't save my picture? There we go, that's better. What is that an old picture of? Oh, my Lizal ball. Alright, whatever. Phew. Yeah, big surprise there. What's coming for me? Air Blight Ganon? Wow, that was a cool shot. Wind Blight Ganon? Ooh. Come to Papa. This is going to be fun. Wind Blight Ganon, Scourge of Divine Beast Van Meadow. Good luck. That thing is one of Ganon's own, and it plays dirty. But it's so windswept. It me 100 years ago, but only because I was winging it. Poor excuse. I can't believe I'm actually saying this. But you must avenge me, Ha! <laughs> yeah, most dead people don't say that, so I can't believe you're saying it either. Dead on. Watch your... Wow, look at that. Whew, okay. What are you doing over there? I'm over here. Try harder. Wow, that tornado is still going and it's destroying rocks. Oh, hi! You're right above me. And you have a gun? It's not cool. Not cool. Right in the eye. Oh, God. Ha! Oh, I should be using the Master Sword. What am I thinking? Duh. It's glowing and everything. Why can't I equip the Master Sword? There we go. 